Hey guys, welcome back. Today I am going to be planning out my month for May. This is what the front of the divider <clears throat> looks like. Excuse me. And um, this is out of Grounded Magic Classic dashboard. Um, happy planner. And I don't know about you, but there is so much going on in May that my poor brain, <laughs> I'm hoping that this becomes like a brain dump of like all the activities and appointments and like all the things um, so that it can clear up my brain for things that I need to get done before the end of April because all my brain can think about and I keep remembering and all the stuff. So um, I need to get this done and out. So come along with me and we will get this planned. So, <clears throat> I am going to be, obviously, I, if, you, if, you're not, if you're new here, I use all the functional planning stuff first. I do all the boxes and stuff that I need, and then I do the decorative, but um, I'm going to be working a lot of, out of the colorful boxes, and then I'm going to be using some of the decorative elements in the garden and the gardening, or garden flowers and the gardening. Um and hopefully uh, be able to just bring some of this into alignment with my brain. Um, so let's get started and I'm gonna do this in what hopefully is the um, most practical way. <laughs> um, bear with me. I am actually going to be taking out the, because I use these mostly, um, and this way I can use the different colors as I need to, and then come back for the slightly bigger ones on particular days that I need more. Um, I think that is it, except for the black. So if you are new to planning, um, do not think that you need to do all the decorative stuff and all the stickers and things like that. Um, I share mine mostly for um, inspirational uh, purposes and um, like somewhat, I don't want to say accountability for me, but kind of. Um, so just keep in mind that, uh, see I already need one. Um, just keep in mind, you don't have to do everything that everybody else is doing and, um, do what works for you. Do what, um, is going to make your calendar, make your planner work for you. You want it to be functional first and foremost, and then fun and decorative. I think the next thing is on the 5th, and I'm trying to find it on my list. Okay, uh, that's a Sunday. Okay, so we're going to put that in green. And I'm just going to kind of, and this is why I decided to do um, the garden flowers and the floral, is because I can put all the colors on here and then use some of the floral and bring it all together. <coughs> Excuse me. So the eighth, I've got one. Okay, <laughs> that's gonna be interesting. Really interesting. I guess I'm gonna be running all over the place. Um, so I am going to do one of these, and then I'm going to do. I think we can do a pink one and kind of offset it and make it fun. Um, two different things in two different directions, and that's gonna be all kinds of fun. And once I get all this done, then I will sit down and write everything out. Um, and then on the ninth, I need one and we will throw a blue in there just for the heck of it because it's fun. You guys are going to look at my month and go, what are you doing and when are you going to be home? I don't know. That is the thing. I don't know. So I have something on the 11th, that's a Saturday, 
Okay, so let me see if I can't find, because I need my, right here they are, they are here. Okay, so I should have pulled these out first. Um, so this is a 4-H meeting that we need to do. And then, let me see, the 17th. Wow, okay, 17th is the following. Okay, so this is, I'm gonna say the concert in that, and then this is the banquet. Let me, I don't want to do blue. Maybe I can do purple, because I don't want to do green either. Where's the other one I had? Oh, there it is, ha ha, see, okay. So I'm thinking I might do a purple down here on the 17th. And I think like most times, most of my um, activities in that are gonna be banking on like Wednesday through Saturday. Um, oh, look, see the 15th, what is on the 15th? Okay, so that is a 4-H. These are stickers I made a long time ago with my Cricut. Um, I was using them a lot and then I lost them. This is one of those batches that didn't get cut out quite right. And this was when I first got my Cricut. So these are probably about four years old. <laughs> um, so, okay, the 22nd. Okay, so the 22nd, I'm gonna need a larger box and we're gonna do I think we're going to do a red if I can find it. Because that will signal to me that it is a full day at the school um, for my son. And <clears throat> who is a senior, so we're just going to throw all the senior stuff for that day in this box. And then, I know I'm going to have to go back again, I think, to some days. So that was the 22nd. And then I have the 24. Let me see. Okay. So that one just needs a little one. That one's more of a burgundy color, but we're just going to do, we're going to pull another green just because it's going to be fun and brighten it up. So there's that on the 24th, and then the 25th is, oh, haha. -ha. Okay. So I'm going to be putting a black one there because it'll make it stand out, and that is, I should, <laughs> this is bad. Uh, so that's my son's graduation party day, and I should have automatically like knew that, but my brain is so muddled that um, it just, it, I can't remember and put everything straight in my head. <laughs> it's just so much um, that it's a little crazy. So the 25th, so the 18th, oh, okay. Yep, that one. And we're going to, I would say do green, but I think we'll do a blue. We have a bright blue and as I said there's so many and I'm not worried on the monthly view I'm not worried about balancing the boxes and stuff on each side because obviously they always end up skewed more towards this side and I do a little bit of decoration and then I write stuff in later but my main thing is making sure that I have the boxes for the pre-planned things and then um, to the 13th, I need a 4-H sticker. Okay, so just getting all this stuff done and, um, hey look, there's Mother's Day. So maybe I will go and find a sticker for that and then one for here so that will kind of dress that up a little bit. And then the 31st, okay, I know what that is, so that is Oh my, so one kid gets out here and the other one gets out here. 
So I think we're going to throw another pink one in just to brighten it up. Um, maybe a muted pink one. Maybe not so bright. So there's that. And as I said, obviously, like, I don't know, if you have kids, most of the stuff is Wednesday through Saturday um, when it comes to uh, planning these things. So I'm going to go through and just make sure um, down my list, because if you can see, this is what it looks like. Um, I'll show you this one. This is what I'm working off of. Um, my future log and on the other side you saw all that and I just literally will take as the year goes on in my Franken planner here um, I will go oh we need an appointment okay so we're gonna be uh, August 21st so I'll write the 21st I'll write who it is for and what and the time and if if it's all jumbled up that's what happens um, so I think let's see so we've got the, I'm going to go over this again, 24th and the 3rd and the 17th and the 8th and the 11th and the 18th and the 8th again and then the 13th and then the 15th and then the 25th and then the 5th. And then the 22nd, and then the 31st, okay, and the 3rd again, and then the 9th, okay. So I have all of that down now. And and honestly, that is how it was on my list. So <laughs> just so you know, that's how it, it comes through. Um, I actually want to look at these because I thought these are so pretty and I've already used some. I don't think I have any of the big ones. I don't want any of the produce in that, of course, yet for right now. So I actually might use like some of these in the days that um, I know are not going to be used. So you know what I'm going to do is I think, yeah, let me see if there's any more um, that I might use and Cause these are so fun. These are just fun. I got them thinking, oh, I'll use them in my garden book. No, <laughs> nope. Haven't used them in what, two years? So, um, yeah, this is where we're at. And then let me see. Oh, look at that. That's fun. Okay. So we will do this and I should go get my calendar book because Hold on, I'll be right back. Let me bring my cart over with everything. I have a calendar, a recollections calendar book, and I think this is the one that has all of the holidays in it. It should. Oh, maybe it doesn't. Oh, they're all small. What happened? I thought I have a book. I just don't know exactly where it is then. Maybe. The months more days okay not this book um okay here's one a slip i don't even know where this came from or what book so don't ask i have no idea so let me see if i can't find labor day new year's president's valentine's april Fool's, father's day independence day mother's day and memorial day here we go We're going to put Mother's Day over there, and then I'm going to find something here just to be fun. Um, I know I just had all those boxes. Okay, here's some. And it'll just bring a little bit more... Um, brightness to it. So I'm going to say we're going to do these little onions. Actually, you know what? We can do something more like this. 
And that way, if I need to write something down in that box, it will be available. So, does anybody else have a senior doing all the senior stuff this year? Because this is crazy. Um, where did my Memorial Day? Um, I don't think that I had as much crazy going on in 21 when we moved and I had one graduating. I don't think we had as much crazy. I honestly don't. Um, Okay, so I think that's all of the holidays we have. Okay. Yeah, and then my husband's birthday is here. So I just had... Here, we'll do one of these. These are fun. And I'll know whose birthday it is, obviously. Um, so we'll put that in there and do a little sparkle, sparkle. And now we get to the fun part. So obviously I have these guys and these. I don't want to do the vegetables and stuff. Let's see decoratively what is in here. This has probably more. Um, so there's obviously the plants and things like that. Look how pretty those are. I don't think I can layer anything up the way and I might just put a note box up there I don't want to do fruit. Okay, so there's some more. I don't want to do that. Ooh, chickens, look at chickens. Okay, so yes, I love my chickens. Um, I love my guinea, y'all. Everyone thinks I'm crazy, but I'm telling you, I love my guinea. And I will give you an example. My guinea this morning were, we have a fenced in backyard and it's like very wide fencing, um, wire, farm fencing and that is for the dogs to not be wandering about so we let them out there go to the bathroom do whatever the guinea obviously if you don't know guinea wander wherever they want to go they do not well, that's that is that clear that's clear okay so they go wherever they want you you cannot keep them pinned you actually don't want to because they will take care of all of the uh bugs all of the oh no no this didn't get set back down right um what are you, all the ticks and the fleas and like everything they will eat all the bugs and they're also an alarm system so you can picture this my dogs went running out of the back door this morning and proceeded to run after the guinea who they thought they could get a hold of they could not because they were on the other side of the fence. Now the guinea seeing the dogs coming were like, oh no, and um, kind of started backing up until they decided, oh, they can't get to us. Then they proceeded to squawk at them kind of almost teasingly, like haha, -ha, and they were prancing back and forth along the fence line. So it was pretty hilarious. Um, I'll save that, I don't know why, but we'll save it. So have that. Um, so it was hilarious. It was it was pretty funny. The dogs were like, oh, oh, I want to get to him. I need to get to him. But they couldn't. <laughs> and you know what? I think I have, where did they go? I have like a big thing of sunflowers that I think I might be able to use. Here they are. So we'll see. I have this sheet. I don't. It came as an individual. I don't know if I got it from Michaels or Walmart or whatever, but I might just throw these in there. Um, I think that's what I'm gonna do along the side. I think I'm gonna put the sunflowers up the way and then I might come in um, along the sides and stuff and in between to do that. So I just thought that that was my funny for the morning. I thought that was hilarious. The, the guinea are teasing the dogs. They're like, ah, oh, you can't get us. Oh. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it was, it was funny to watch because the dogs were a little perplexed as to why they could not get a hold of these critters. Now I do have, 
uh, two black labs and a Bernese Mountain Dog, who is my herding dog. I don't want to overlap it that much. He's my herding dog. He is super sweet, but he feels the need to herd them all. And I think that's just the way he's made, um, his breeding. So not, not the way he's made, but uh, just, I think it's his breeding. And um, it is fantastic to watch this dog um, go after him. But he, he doesn't, like, go after him to, like, grab him. Because we've had one of the labs get a hold of a chicken before. And um, she's more of a retriever style. She didn't um, do anything to the chicken except to pull some... Uh, feathers out but she and she she just pinned the chicken it was but the chicken shouldn't have been in the backyard area where they because the dogs have their space and then when we put, let them out in the pasture we block off the farm animals and so yeah that was um it was hilarious this morning it was just too funny so I think I'm gonna put this one down here because that's enough to cover a little bit and then we can do do I know what I'm doing elsewhere no but we're just gonna kind of fill in here and there and um, I kind of want to I want to do some of the birds but I kind of want to do some of these potted plants but I don't think that's a I don't think that's going to happen because it doesn't seem like it goes. Um, I don't know if this one has um, some quotes, but I think I also want to put... Yeah, that one. I'm going to take this one and... Oh, uh oh. It doesn't have a box thing to, like, a number, but we're going to just fill this in down here just to give it, and I might put a sticker over it. I don't know. We shall see. But it's filling out, so, um, and normally I don't get it this filled out, but normally do not have it this busy. Um, I'm just trying to see if there's any, like, fun quotes. I don't think there are. Um, no, there's not. And that's okay. So, we've got these back here that I can fill out in between and then I might just use the pots and going for the clear this time. It just makes it easier. Um, I don't know why I didn't do this before. So there we go. Um, so yeah. Oh. Okay, maybe we put this one back and go for one that is not pretty designed. Maybe we just take the thing off. Because I can never get them back in there. Just quite right. So we'll get that off. And then use these. along the way. I'm thinking maybe I should put some washi, but I don't think I have anything that I want to use. Um, you know what? They have washi in one of these, don't they? Probably put one of the watering cans in with it. 
I have washi in one of these that I think will look really cute. Oh, look at that. I completely forgot about those. I should probably throw a bird up there. That's cute. I think the washi's in here. If you've watched my videos before, you know sometimes I can get a little um, unfocused and scatterbrained. But that's why I'm doing this one early for, you know, but that way I can, no, okay. Um, it doesn't even have to be really big either, but I think I might do just a green Or maybe I don't want to do that one. If I do, well, maybe I do pink. I don't think I have, I don't want to do pink, pink, and I don't want to do blue. I'm trying to think of what I want to bring over, and I probably want to bring a pink, but I don't have a. I have like this one, but I don't want to do that right underneath there. Um, Hold on a minute, I'll be right back. Okay, so I have this, and I think what I'm gonna do is use it kind of like it's sitting almost on a decorative brick kind of a thing. So I'm going to pull this up. Tag yellow. And slide this underneath. This is a, um, no, why did I do that? It uh, varies. It um, I can't think of the right word. Oop. See, and here I am, just being ridiculous. Anyway, so to make this easier, there we go. I'm just cut it and make it straight because I don't want to do that. Um, so there's that. Nope. You need to go up. So it'll have some color to it, variations of color. And I will fix those in just a moment. But I wanna get to the end here. There we go. So there we go. So it'll kind of just break it up a little bit there. Um, and where was it? There was, I saw a flower pot. I think it was the birds. Maybe I will. Look how pretty. I don't think the birds are going to go. I think we're just going to stick with the plants. And we'll go with this one. And we'll go with this one. And I like this one. Um, I think we're going to go. Maybe right here, because we don't have to fill in every single space, but don't want. I can have all my potted plants together. Um, I have that one. I don't have this one. Oh, maybe I do have that one. I don't think I do. I have a smaller one. And then maybe we will put kind of didn't plan that out well, did I? Oh, well, no, those are all paper and I don't want to do that. I want to stick with a clear because this is seeing being shown through. I think I'm going to end with this one again on, oh, come on, there we go. We're going to do that. So it kind of breaks it up and gives it a little bit of like, you know, decor there. I really wanted to do, um, some other stuff, but there's only so much that I can do. So I kind of want to, this have a smaller, no, it doesn't. Cause I wanted to bring in 
some of the decorative elements here. Oop, come on. I don't want to come off the page, so. Because I can bring these in and then throw stickers on top. Kind of line that up just right. So there's that. And I think I want at least one more something or other over there. Um, so are you guys ready? Because summer, I feel, is going to be here ooh, way before we're all ready. Um, I think it's going to, what does that say? Oh, we can for gardening. Um, I think it's really going to be here before any of us are ready for it. But also... Um, think that, uh, I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready. So I kind of want to put him down here somewhere. Maybe right here. Take off some of the excess clear put that down there and get it out of my way we're gonna put that there and then I probably should keep these side by side because I'm going to end up overdoing it somewhere and going oh that was too much and I think we're going to I'm going to lay this across here because I don't have a whole lot and I just want to kind of, but I still want something a little bit down here. I don't want anything big. Um, but I do think I'm going to bring in a butcher flag and just kind of, I think we're going to put him down this way. There we go. <clears throat> I kind of want something down here, kind of um, branchy almost. I'm trying to look in the other book because I have these clear ones. I don't want a bird down there and I don't necessarily want another one of these and these are kind of on a big side to be putting over here as well. Maybe we will just put, look, a little vase. These are cute, these little daffodils. So um, I do want to let you know if you're here this long, thank you for sticking around. Um, I have, I will be doing a um, garden planner update soon, and um, this is you're too stuck with stuff. And I will be doing um, some uh, in there. Will probably be some of my. What do you call it? Pollinator garden. So if you guys are interested in that, um, stay tuned. I also am thinking I might do a, um, oh, you know what I didn't do? I did not look at the sports schedule, guys. So I'm going to need to go back and put some boxes in there. And I think I'm going to use uh, plain black ones just to offset. I can't believe I forgot that. Goodness me. All right. So I'm not quite done. Anyway, um, I was thinking of doing a um, graduation party prep. Kind of like, you know, tips and things that you can do. So if you are interested, um, and it's not just for homeschool, obviously. It's... Um, everybody everybody who has a high schooler who's going to do a graduation party um so here you get to see i'm not pulling anything up this is just going right over that um oh look more stuff on that day um <laughs> if you are interested in that so look for that coming up on the ninth the ninth 
I don't know what else is going on on the 9th, but hey, we'll all just stack stuff together. Uh, the 16th, oh, we're just going to go right down the list here. Oh, and I didn't put, there's an appointment there too. Um, I'll have to add another box there. So, and then the 23rd here. So there's that. Um, I need to put, I don't think, or was that on the 9th? Okay. So I need to probably switch these two out because it's just going to make more sense to put the blue one on top for the appointment. I don't have my, I didn't pull my tweezers out. And my fingernails just cannot grab. There we go. That's not perfectly straight, but that's okay. So look for those videos coming up. Um, I'm gonna get this in my planner here. Find the right section. I'll let you in on a little thing. I have not done my tracker at all for this month just because life's been crazy. Um, if you're wondering, I am just going to ignore, I am actively ignoring the binding, the, the spine on a lot of these layouts because I'm just that stubborn and I don't want to redo it. Um, like last year I had to because there were stripes and I couldn't handle they were too bright. These are pretty muted and that's why I went ahead with this um, layout. So this is my May layout. If you haven't guessed, I am ready for all the flowers, all the garden, all the outdoor stuff, um, and all the warm weather. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this and it um, gave you some inspiration and brightened your day. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching.